Hi there and welcome to Squid Gaming. Now this is something I'm so excited about making a video for because I have been a very patient person. Now as some people know with Pokemon Go, now I'm starting to rhyme, I've got a flow. It, that, nah, that's the end of that. It was not released in the UK until today. Some people have been getting hold of it in less than, you know, proper manner. And I was a good girl and I was like, nay! I will not do such barbaric things. I will wait the visual release. So all my friends were playing it. And, <laughs> what am I kidding? I don't have any friends. Uh, I saw people on the internet playing it and it broke my heart. So then today I was at work and it came out on the app store and I had a little hyper of ventilation and downloaded it. But then I thought, ah, oh, no, I need to make a video about the early days, the early days of my Pokemon Go adventure. So I sat at work and I didn't even play it. Do you realize how hard this has been? Do you realize how I have suffered? I've waited a long time to do this. I'm quite excited. I even um, I had this hat, which I thought I should wear, like. I mean, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, so there is Pokemon nearby. So I haven't even got my starter Pokemon. I did, you know, spruce myself up, gave myself a fresh new look. But today we're gonna be attempting to get you. So I'm going to step outside my house now and I'm going to ignore these losers because that's how you get it. So yeah, let's go on an adventure, shall we? Okay, so when you start, you'll have um, you'll have three Pokemon. You'll have Bulbasaur, Charmander and Squirtle. God, I forgot his name right then. Um, but you need to ignore them. Ignore them. Do not, do not go and fight them. So I'm walking at the moment and the moment I'm walking towards Bulbasaur. But I am not going to fight him. Oh, let's go. I'm just going to carry on going. So you, you run. And you just carry on walking. And they'll follow you, those little creepy buggers. They'll follow you. Oh, don't you worry. Oh, the police are on to me. Help! Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, so it's very bright outside, so hopefully you can see what I'm recording. But basically, there is Pikachu. So what I did is I walked in a, basically just a straight road down from near where I lived um, and just kept walking. And basically, when you get far enough away from them, they will automatically respawn near you. Just keep doing that. I think I had to do it like five times before Pikachu was included in that. Um, just for good measure as well, I kept getting into fights with them and running away. Because um, I thought that might help. So yeah, I think it was a good five times and I read it was three times. Or maybe it was six times even. So yeah, persevere because it might, it might take a really long time. And people are looking at me very strangely. Right, so I'm going to catch Pikachu. Oh wow, my nails. My my thumb, ugh. <laughs> there he is. She is. It is. All right, I'm gonna. I'm gonna catch it. Get. Yeah. Okay. Hold the actual phone. Literally. Uh, someone has taken the nickname Squid Gaming. Who takes that nickname? That's my name. That's my name. Why would someone take that? That's not just a casual nickname that someone perchance has. Oh yeah. All my friends call me Squid Gaming. No, they don't. Why would you do that to me? So because every squid related num name under the sun was bloody taken. I even tried Squiddy. Why, 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 why? It's like that name's not available. It's like, well, what, what? And then I remembered that everyone in the world is playing this apart from me. Uh, so my name is Squid Gaming Lid and Professor whatever his fake oak name is. It's like, cool, great name. It's like, no, it's not. It's a shit name and you know it. Don't patronize me. The excitement is hurting me. I found a pigeon. Get it? It's a pigeon. Okay, so it turns out that that's not a Pokestop, that's a freaking gym. It's a gym and I need to work out and train my guns before I'm allowed. It needs to be level five apparently. The good news is that all this walking as I try and find Pokemon is burning off the hot dog and halloumi cheese and, and burger that I had for lunch. So there's truly joy in every tragedy as Shakespeare once said. All right, not being funny yet, but I've been walking for a good 15 seconds and I haven't found anything. According to Twitter, there's bloody Pokemon. You can't go to the toilet without Pokemon jumping out. All right, I don't mean to be suspicious yet, but there's kids in this park. Are the kids stealing the Pokemon? Am I gonna have to fight the children? Do I fight the children? Okay, update. I decided not to fight the children because I remember that advice my mum always told me to not fight children, so. I'm not gonna fight them. Good news is, apparently that's a poker stop. So I'm going over there. My God, there's this nearby. 
I'm just gonna, I'm gonna steal it and shove it in a bowl. Okay, update. I'm gonna fight the bird with the fabulous, fabulous hair. Okay, update. I've thrown a lot of balls, and the uh, the bird is not biting m m my balls. <laughs> uh, well, I'm sorry. I got the bugger in the ball. So now I just needed to put some welly in the old finger flip. And I think it's frozen. Yeah, I think it's frozen. Because nothing's happened for a while now. <gasps> hello, hello. These are the best Pokemon of them all. Like seriously, how many places does a weedle have to hide? I mean, I know it's technically a tiny little bug and I'm in a big old park, so to answer that question, Correctly, it has a lot of places to hide, but I feel like I've been walking for a very long time and this little freaky bug has not showed himself and I'm cross and disorientated from sun exposure. Right, I'm home. So, that was a bit disappointing. Um, maybe you're meant to be less lazy than me and more explorational and go all around the area. I just kind of travelled in this park near my house and I found one Pidgeot which crashed my phone. I swear to God that Weedle was nowhere to be found. I looked everywhere, kind of everywhere. I gently scoured some areas and it wasn't there. Uh, and then I thought, okay, well maybe I'll find something on the walk home. Nothing, so what I'm thinking is, day one, servers in the UK, maybe stuff's just not quite sorted out yet, sorted itself out yet, so I'm gonna persevere and do some more vlogs in different areas of London, and maybe that will find more things. But as it stands, I just have a Pikachu, but hopefully the Pikachu guide helped you. So if you'd like to see more Pokemon Go uh, videos, then let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you haven't already, and press that like button, and I will see you next time. Take care, play lots, and have fun.